Hey everyone, Sonia Jones here, Outreach Representative with the HSHS Medical Group, and today I'm here with Keith Griffith. Keith is the VP of Quality here at HSHS Medical Group. Thank you for joining us today. Thank you. Now Keith, we've had a lot of talk the last few weeks about um, hand washing, about masks, about gloves, about all kinds of things, but today I want to specifically talk to you about hand washing because a lot of people think they're getting their hands clean, but really they may not be. So can you walk us through a proper hand washing um, tutorial? Yep, be happy to. And so what you're going to see today as we uh, demonstrate with uh, the paint on the, on the gloved hand is going to show how you would do this with soap and or hand sanitizer. Right, okay. Because the trick is if the soap or the hand sanitizer doesn't make contact with a, a spot on the hands, then there is no opportunity to kill the organisms that would be in that spot. Right, okay. All right, so let's get started then. I'm going to take a little bit of soap or paint and put it in my hand. So right. the, I think what typically happens is, is we get that dollop of, of soap or hand sanitizer mm -hmm. and then we go right to rubbing our right. hands. And, and that's typically where people stop, right? right? And so if we stop there and look, we'll see how much area we're not getting covered. Ooh. So we're seeing all in between the fingers, the tops of the hand, obviously, you know, we got none of. Right. So then, you know, typically people say, well, yeah, but I also go in between, right? Okay. So go ahead and work in between. Okay. And if you see that you need more soap, you can always grab oh, it, obviously, yeah. okay? So you feel like you got a pretty good yeah. job there? All yeah. right, so let's take a look at the at the hands and see. So it looks hands like look on good. the palm side, we're good, mm -hmm. right? right? Let's flip them on over. And so we have missed all of these uh -oh. areas across the fingers. Okay, right? well, let me get so a little more soap. If we're doing this activity, we hit and we go in between the fingers, right. then now we gotta figure out how we're gonna get the tops of the hands, okay. right? So build that in. What okay. would you do to... Cover well, the tops of the hands. The tops, I'd probably just take my palm since okay, the soap is good, already there good. and then scrub the back. Yep. So then we gotta remember to actually do the other side. Right. Yep. yep. So and now you start to see why 15 to 20 seconds with soap is important because right. it takes that long, right, to actually get everything covered, all the spots covered, and to give the soap a chance to actually work against those organisms. Right. Good. So now we're looking pretty good, right? Uh, yeah. But <laughs> I see some blue, right? right. So the, the tops thumbs. of the thumb. And then look at these fingertips. Oh, so a little yeah. bit of blue on the fingertips. And that gets into why it's important with the uh, fingernails, right? Yeah. Uh, if I'm not even getting the tips, as you can see here, right. then I'm definitely not getting in underneath the, the very tip and underneath the fingernail. Okay. So there so, you go. Yeah. So that next trick then is when I've done the in-betweens and I'm covering the backs, mm -hmm. then I finish with drilling in. Uh, we always kind of said, you know, like you take those fingers, put them together and you drill it into the palm. Right. And then you switch over and do the same. Oh, good. yeah. And so now as we take a look, we're getting pretty good coverage of the entire hand. No blue showing through. Uh, we're seeing orange everywhere. Right. Awesome. Now we're totally covered. Good work. All right. Thanks for watching, everyone. Make sure you keep your hands washed, clean, sanitized, and stay healthy. We'll see you next time.